biggest obstacle was being accepted by other parents and other boys in the clubs growing up. And a, lot, and a big struggle was trying to find other girls to relate to and talk to, and it was very hard. It was very hard at first, and I, there was times where I wanted to quit because I was very lonely, and I just traveled with my dad a lot. It was, that was the only part I liked about it, was hanging out with my dad and just having fun on the road and, and traveling to different tournaments. But I got very unmotivated at times, getting beat up. And, but there, then I hit that, I broke through the brick wall, and I, I started to like it because I started winning, and I had hope. And then I started meeting new girls, and it just rolled on from there. It makes me very happy that there's more girls um, in the wrestling world now, like especially around here, because I I didn't see another girl for like another like maybe sometimes a state. I wouldn't see people that that were ever in New York State, but now there's there's teams in Section One, Section Eleven, and there are a couple girls in Section Nine. But it's very nice to wrestle and see a girl like on the mat with me, and I don't know, it makes it feel like we're achieving something. Sophia's great competition. Um, She's, I've wrestled with her since we were younger and she's always been a role model to me and you know she's one of the best girls I've ever seen so it was, I started wrestling because my brother did it and I saw him beating up other kids and I was like if the boys can do it I can do it I want to be like them and then I did jujitsu because my brother did it and the person who ran it started a girls wrestling team for his daughters so I joined there and that's how I started and then in seventh grade they pulled me up on the boys team and I've been wrestling on there since and now I wrestle for the New York national team and like we just travel all over and wrestle. I hope other girl wrestlers look at this and like are inspired and want to start wrestling too and I'm hoping New York sanctions it and we finally have girls high school teams.